hello students we will study clustering of social graphs let's understand what is meant by communities a collection of individuals with a dense relationship patterns within a group and sparse links outside the groups betweenness the vertex betweenness centrality that is bc of v of a vertex b is defined as follow so bc of vertex v is equals to submission uv which belongs to the v u and v are again a vertexes which belongs to v the v is a different set of all vertexes in a graph submission uv v so the through which between two points we have to find out that is a v and there if there exist a path so the sub, uh, sigma u w is a thing but and total shortest path between the node u and w and sigma u v v the total number shortest path between node u and w that passes through v let's understand it by numerical so we have this given graph and we have to find out the betweenness centrality now let's consider this c point okay now this is c now first of all we have to understand all the possible edges a b yes ab exist yes ab is there that is passing through c we are considering we are trying to find out the betweenness for the c we are trying to find out c c going through ab no direct edge is there so it is not going through c so we will be writing zero exist one ad ad path is there ad path is there Yes, it is part there. We are adding one. That is going through C. It is going to C. Yes, it is going through C. We are adding it one. A E A E Yes, A E path is there. That is passing through C. Yes, it is passing passing through C. So we are adding here one and here one. So on we can find out A F A D B E B F D E D E D E exist. Yes, D E exist. But it is passing through C, so we are writing it zero. For it, a path exists, we are writing one. The, it is passing through C. No, we are writing it zero. So we calculated all uh, sigma u w and sigma u w v. Now we will take the ratio of this. One uh, zero upon one, we get the value zero. Then one upon one, we get the value one. And so on, we calculate. Now these are the elements where we are able to find out the betweenness of C. So the betweenness centrality for C is equals to six. So after summation of all this, we come to the value as six. Now uh, consider the node C D. And as D having a same kind of uh, structure like a C having network, so again the value for D will be six. As A is not coming in between at any point, the betweenness for the node A is zero. Betweenness for B is again a zero. Betweenness for E again a zero. The re reason is very simple because those are the side nodes. those are not coming in between any nodes so this is how we calculate a betweenness for all the nodes in a graph let's consider node a we will find out the for bc bc does a is coming into between them no so we are adding 0 by 1 that is 0 bd bd there exist a node does a is coming between them no there will be 0 now be 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 the path exists does a is coming between them yes it exists so there is another path also but we have to consider only shortest path as per the definition a b to e there exists the edge and b to e there is a, a between them so we are taking it one by one that is one let's understand directly from this point de de this exist a path yes exist there but there exist two shortest path d c f e length is 3 d 
D B A E. Yes, length is three. So there are two path exists, shortest path, but only one of them is going through node A. So we will take one by two equals to zero point five. That's how we calculated the value. Now all we will sum them. 0 plus 0 plus 1 plus 0 0 0 plus 0.5 0 plus 0. So between the centrality for A is 1.5. So we only sum these two others are 0. No need to add them. Let's find out the betweenness for the B. In the betweenness to find out the B, A C there exists a edge. Yes, there exists a edge. The B is coming between. Yes, it is coming between. Then A D. A D S exists. B is coming between. Yes, it is coming between. So we take it as again one. Others are zero. D E D to E. There exists a two path. So we'll take two, and there exists A in between. In one of the path, we are writing it one. So it is we get the one point five. So one plus one plus zero point five, which comes down to two point five. Similarly. We can find out the betweenness centrality for C also, which comes down to 2.5. As D is a side node, at any point it is not going to come between any of the edges, so we take it as the zero. For E, for E, all the edges is zero, but only for A F, which is the shortest path. And E is coming in between them, so we take it as a one. Now let's calculate it for F. Only C E and D E, which gives the value as. This is how we calculated the betweenness value for all the nodes. Thank you.